Whew. Good Lord, that thing's kind of heavy, that ladder. But only because it's an eight foot ladder and going up and down the stairs and stuff, but I wouldn't have it any other way because I need it. Okay, I was, you know what, there's three lights up here. I was gonna take one down and get it figured out first before I made a video and I thought, you know what, nothing doing. I've never taken this kind out and I'm gonna have you, whoops, I'm gonna have you see what I see, I guess. See if we can't get this figured out on how to take this cover off. Let's see if you can see what's going on with that light off. Okay, I guess you can see that. this one to that one there okay let's just see what's what's happening get my ladder redirected here flipped over this way too and that metal is part of the plastic but I don't think it is. Got any tricks here for me? I don't know. It sure it sure looks suspect there. Looks like them just mask around that and this other one good grief how can I figure this out jeez okay let's look at that one that one there it looks like it's kind of kind of the same um, that it's loose This plastic goes up to here and it goes back to a metal bit and I thought this plastic went up through that with um, threads on it. I've seen one almost this big before uh, that I unscrewed and you know it's not it's not coming and I'm thinking maybe maybe that Okay, wait, 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 wait for it. <laughs> I'm pulling down on this. And it is, okay. Huh. It's kind of, it's kind of coming down. Is there, oh, there is a clip. Good Lord. There is a clip on it. Ah, there. Look at that. Wow. Why was that so hard? Okay, I'll get you up here. Um, gee, I'll take the other ones down. I think we'll get the light back on. Okay, 
I'm not going to turn the video camera off. I want you to see what I see. I want you to, you know, I've never taken this this type off. See the, this plastic had a lip on it. See this lip? And there's nothing else on it. These are, I'm going to have Momi clean these off too. It's just got, it just comes straight up. And it was like, how, how is this going to come off? Let's get you up there. I wonder if it's okay to show with the light fixture. Okay, see this? It's a little spring-loaded goodie. And so the plastic, that plastic just fit up in between that and went up. See, here's another, here's another clip here. That's all it did. I wasn't quite sure. Cause see, here's, here's the whole, here's the whole light. See how it's twisting? And it's twisting, and this is where they had it installed. The, the mounting screw is right there. And see, there's another one right there. And it tells me that those, those screws are not tight, are they? I should get up there. Seems as though I have this all out. Um, I'll tighten that, and that'll keep that a little bit better. Okay, let's turn this off. I don't know if that's going to help. If that's going to help you see it. See that bracket? All it did is I kind of pulled down. It just separated between that. That's that's all it was holding up there. It's just that that little bit of friction. I've never seen a light fixture like that before. And there's four of them. Okay? And see how this thing moves? All of them are like that. Look how big the gap is between the ceiling and the back side of the, of the, uh, the fixture. You know, this should be up there snug. So I'm not gonna turn this camera off. I'm gonna set it back up here so that you can see now how this, how we're gonna get these next ones off. Okay. This should be a lot easier this time. Here's, here's that second one. And you know, even the painters might have had an issue with them. And the last thing I want is for somebody to, to break this and have to go buy one of those. Where on earth would you get that? I'll bet you you could not get that at, a, at any box store. You know, probably have to go to a wholesale electrical house. And you probably have to go to two or three of them. And they'll say, what brand is it? What's this? What's that? And who knows what you'd have to do. Look at that. See, I'm, that's it. How simple could that be? Just pull down on it. And remember this one was twisting too? See? That's because on the mounting bracket, they just don't have it tight, do they? Not at all. I'll have to run and get my my Phillips screwdriver. I'll, I'll, I'll do that for you too. Just so you can see what I'm talking about. Okay. This over here now. I'll pull this one down. Nice and simple. Once you know how something comes off, and see, you don't have to mess with, with any. You don't have to break any. All you do is watch Joe figure it out. And if, and if I had to break it, you would learn from that, wouldn't you? This one, that's loose. Look at that. Simple Simon Says, pull down, and that's all you got to do. And those will be nice and easy to reinstall. All I have to do, oh, you want to see me? You want to see me put one back up, dude? Okie dokie. Got to get it on the outside of that. Easier said than done. I guess once you know exactly where that is, make sure it's on the outside of everything. And Okay, where is that? <laughs> Don't know about that. It's 
not even, it's not pushed all the way. Okay, yeah, you can have to spend a little effort on it. If you get up high, you can see what's going on. And the spring-loaded goodie, I'll probably need a little screwdriver or a pair of uh, a putty knife or something like that to make sure those are pushed in properly or do it by feel. See, this wants to flex this a little bit and so I know what I'm going to have to do once I get it up there I'll just take a putty knife put push on that you know once this is up there and then gently push it on it looks like it's going to take a little bit of an effort to get those back up that's okay now you know all right I'll be right back I'll have my Phillips screwdriver with me and we'll tighten those light fixtures down, making sure the light switch is turned off so that you're not up there. I mean, you could have the you could have the light on and get up in there, but you know, be safe rather than sorry.